This is a Game Caviar production. All right, caviars and caveats. It's not having it in the Game Caviar Studios. I was cruising through Steam the other day, the uh, online game superstore. It's like the Walmart of video games on the computer. But anyway, I came across this free-to-play game by Sony Online Entertainment called Bullet Run. And I downloaded it because it was free to play. And I started playing it for free. Hmm, imagine that, right? Anyway, this game is pretty cool. Uh, and I'll tell you why. The whole thing is set up as some sort of wicked, uh, maniacal game show. Uh, right there in the, in the middle of the match, you see that big thing hovering around. That's a camera. And they have a few other cameras that follow you around the map. Okay, and the whole premise of this is that the team deathmatch is being televised somewhere. So if you get a really good kill or something really big happens, you'll hear a crowd and that crowd will start cheering and blah, blah, blah. What they what, what they also have added are two commentators that say little things here and there, blah, blah, blah. Like, oh, my goodness, he should have saw that coming or he was just a speed bump or oh, the med crew is going to have to be working overtime. They say really corny things. It's weird. It's a, uh, it's a good idea on paper. Like, if I read this on paper, I'd be like, hell yeah, man. Let's play this immediately. Let's do it. And when you start playing it, you're like, oh, this, this is kind of cheesy. One of the cool things that you can do in this game is that when you kill somebody, after you kill them, you can taunt the way you do, like, a little dance or whatever. You have different taunts. And right there, you see the reload thing that kind of reminds me of uh, Gears of War. To where if you don't stop it right there in the perfect spot, then your gun will jam up and then you'll panic and you're like, oh my god, what's going on? Anyway, they take a bunch of things that are really cool, but it was really poorly executed. Out of a, uh, a five, one to five scale, I would give it a three. Uh, because it's free to play, it is pretty fun. And it is something that you can definitely do for a little while just to waste time in between playing some something else better. You know, and it's different. It's a different flow from Call of Duty, Battlefield, um, Counter-Strike, games like that. Uh, I haven't noticed any hackers in this game. I hope it stays that way. Uh, I mean, if you, if you play this game and you like it, and you like it enough to where you're semi-convinced that you need to pay for it to keep playing and to get perks, don't do that. It's a free-to-play game, and it's fun. If you really have, like, if I had extra money a month, like, really a lot of extra money a month, I still wouldn't pay for this game because it just doesn't grab me that much. Uh, it's not really that great of a game to pay for every month. I understand why they would ask you to pay but I don't think that it's that you need to in this game. It's not really something that you want to do. I, I don't want to do it. It's not something that you should do, I should say. I don't know what you want to do. You could play this game and be like, oh my God, this game is amazing. Yes, take my money, Sony Online Entertainment. Take it all. But me, I'm like, I'm not going to do it because I don't see the need to do it. So whatever. They start you off with a nice gun. It's an MP5. I will give you a tip. If you play this game and you get to the point to where you can buy guns through credits with the game, then I buy the AUG because the AUG is, is a deadly gun and you can just mow people down. That's the gun that I use now, not in this match, but the match that I played today. It's the gun that I use. It's a really good gun. You can have grenades and all sorts of stuff. You just switch your guns, uh, switch your weapons somehow. I don't know. I got my key mapper all mapped crazy. All I know how to do is run, duck, aim down sight, and murder people. That's all I need. I don't need a grenade. I don't need a knife. I just need a gun, bullets. Boom, I'm there, and I'm killing people left and right. It's pretty cool. If you downloaded this weekend, they they are having a double XP weekend. Double XP is like the thing for online shooters now. I like it because it's pretty cool, especially in Battlefield, because it takes forever for me to level up. In this, if you, it's since it's double XP, you will rank up fairly quickly, and you can also get a good feel for the game. So, in the comment section below, Please let me know if you have played this game or if you plan on downloading this game. If you have Steam, just try it out for a little while. It's free. If you don't like it, just delete it. I think that a lot of people will like it because it's uh, it's just something to pass the time. It's not the worst online shooter at all. It's just not really polished to be a contender. Like, comment, subscribe, spread the word. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studio, and I'm out. 
This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.